The BBC's thrilling Top Gear show returned this week, much to the delight of white men. But don't worry if you missed that in every episode of Top Gear ever, because cut and paste maestro's cassette boy have distilled every episode of Top Gear ever into one easy to munch package, which starts when I drop my hand onto the desk. This is a motoring show. It's very irritating and a little bit boring. To give you a taste of what you can expect, we have prepared a little montage. Can you drive a car? Driving is easy. Driving is extremely difficult. This is important. I don't like electric boot closing. Jeremy, I've had enough, seriously. I just don't like being on Top Gear. It's awful. It's awful, you know, and I hate it. I present this entire show with two penises. It was a cop show, uh, in essence. Halfords! <laughs> <laughs> we won the war. <laughs> then you rape the other motorists. <laughs> Racial stereotyping. <laughs> Last week, we were running guns from Libya into Mali and fighting a traffic warden, who, by the way, has just hung himself. <laughs> Anyway, tonight we are having a race up the side of New Zealand from here to the prostitute's front door. Now, my guest tonight is utterly pointless. Who is it, me? Richard Hammond is a mealy-mouthed, small-minded idiot. You are sacked. You are going to be shot in front of your family. I have got a photograph of the replacement for Richard Hammond and James May. But now, the blacks 